All right. Do we have corrupt intervention? Uh, be very careful. This could be a Billy. All right. So a little bit of context. We are playing solo queue. And at the end of this match, one of my teammates is going to be very upset. Try to pay attention to what each of them is doing and see if you can figure out who it is before it happens. Because we were sent to the farm. This is bad. I don't like this. Oh, never mind. An M1 happened. Yeah, sorry. Uh, I don't know who, what kind of killer would send themselves to the farm. Maybe... Hmm, think about it, Chad. Uh, a Billy... Uh, no, farm... The, the gens are quite open, so you can do those little drift Billy strats. I'm thinking maybe it's a Huntress. Uh, it's not a Skull Merchant or else you would see a different HUD, wouldn't you? Wait, is that what I'm seeing right now? It, is it a skull merchant? No, that that black uh, that black uh, outline is the normal right now. I can't tell. I think I think you would see it. Yeah, same same if you were Sadako. You have like a different outline. Uh, same if you're playing Freddy, and you know you you see it. My guess is that it's Huntress. If a rubber gets hit early on like that, yeah. You know. No kid. Oh, we do have Kindred. It is a blight. Well, that's hardly surprising. Hello, my love. Get this fat dog in here. Get this fat dog. Here so I can pet his ass. Yes. Good boy. What do you do this morning? He peeped and pooped. He peeped and pooped and did he meet other dogs? No. Good. The path of the alpha male dog must be walked alone. And now we went for a picture. Ah. Fat dog. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. I'll turn my AC on and off to keep myself in homeostasis. Thank you. Bye bye. Uh, we wanna, in, we wanna. Oh, 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 she shouldn't do that. We wanna go for the rescue, but at the same time, we can't make it too obvious. Okay. Uh, I would not have the Jake. Yeah, it's in me. I would not have the Jake come for the rescue. Jake, no, don't use urban evasion. It's a trap. Well, shit. At least we give him a distraction, I hope. Um, no alchemist ring by the looks of it. I think I can go one. Okay, that seems like it's not... Ooh, hold up. That could be bad. Pretend to run. Pretend to run. And then come back, maybe? Oh, shit. I think I see what he's doing. Oh, that was a bit risky. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I could have... I, I don't know if I could have made it around the corner, but I could have done something better there. Maybe a little crouch around the corner. Good for him, though. Good play. Uh, we have a pain dress. That's not nice. Damn, dudes. The fact that we're a three and my gen that was at like 30 is the most progress is not a great tiding. She did a little swing there. This is a bit of a dead zone, isn't it, Chad? Up until the next one. I knew it, but... Alright, so this is what the whole video is all about. Shack Pallet. Normally, I would advise you to drop it and play it as safe as possible, especially at the start, because you will be robbing the killer of a lot of pressure. But at this moment, I thought that the killer had way too much pressure already, and if I dropped it with his add-ons, it was very likely that he would catch me shortly after. I would be giving myself a bit of safety, but then probably going down anyway. It was my estimation that I actually had to take the risk or else my team would fall apart. Ideally, I would drop the pallet from the opposite end so that it would be as easy as possible to make it elsewhere and rob as much time from the killer as possible. And luckily, it kind of paid off. What should I have done, Chad? I have no idea where he is. All right, we're gonna try to maybe get him to do something risky here. And if I don't drop the pallet just yet, who knows? Maybe this team gets back on its feet. Mm -hmm. Alright, now it's time, Chad. Now it's time. Oh, he missed it! 
Alright, he's breaking it. Unfortunately, we only have a very minor thing. Just make the line of sight disappear. Yeah, yeah, he thinks. <laughs> what are you doing, son? Oh. Uh. Oh, that's so good, that's so good, that's so good! Uh, that's not exactly what I was hoping, but hey, we'll take it. Yeah, I know, it doesn't make me feel very good. Yeah, I know, that was right on top. Bro! Please, Janzu! I mean, she's that on hook, maybe she's just a bit scary. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, it's no pain rest, so you don't need to let go, just good luck. Oh, dear. That was a good chase, yeah, it was, it was. Sad part is, you know, like, th th there's like a slider on light, right? And there's two things that I think are really, really important for you to even have a chance to do anything close to what we did. There's two conditions, and you're not guaranteed to get either of them. Number one, if the blight has no add-ons. If the blight has no add-ons, then suddenly you have a lot more room for, m for mistakes. It it's like playing against a nurse that doesn't have three blinks. You have more room for mistakes. And all these little dodges and making it to the next loop and so on, they, they can all happen. And then the other one is if the blight is a bit clumsy or a bit rusty or still a bit of a beginner. If the blight is a bit of a beginner, then they're gonna panic, they're gonna make mistakes that they would otherwise not make. So, what's gonna happen when you play against a blight, or against a nurse for that matter, but especially against a blight for the add-on bit, that has good add-ons and is also really, really solid? You have nothing. You can do absolutely nothing. Every little mistake that this man would have made, gone. Uh, drop a pallet, they can eviscerate it. Uh, take a hit and make distance. Uh, you know what, sure, I'll take it. This is the unsafest location ever, but it's not gonna happen. Nothing's gonna happen otherwise. Hmm. I don't know where he's checking. Maybe he's got a threesome on that side. It's totally viable. It's totally possible. Oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please. Thanks. You know what, we'll take it. Um, thank you, Nia. I'm so sorry I can't return the favor. Uh, I'm using reassurance just so that he knows. If the killer was here, I wouldn't have done that. But yeah, um, let's try to finish this gen. Just three man on it if possible. Oh, right, there's that lock. Uh, what could we do? We're all the hook except for Feng. Could I get a pallet save on this lady? That's the only thing I can think of. If the last gen gets done, I could also flop. Oh, that's good. That's good. Patience. Oh, if I had a flashy or something. That would be so good. Uh, I could be helping them on their gen. Mm, not good, shot. not good. What? We had three gens started. Can I miss a skill check on purpose? Miss a skill check on purpose? Miss a skill check on purpose? Spam the space bar? Skill, skill check on purpose? Please, 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 please. Maybe get his attention. Yes. Wonderful. That's perfect, that's perfect. Now maybe he thinks. Yeah, well, that's add-ons. Sorry, I knew I could have dropped it, but then he flops on one side and it's over. Good luck, guys! Good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck. Please, please, please get it. Adrenaline Fang. Come on, dude. One person through the gates, and I'm happy that we fought. Does he have more rushes? No, I don't think so. I can tell you, Chad. I can't tell you. Uh, I mean, I can tell you which add-ons he doesn't have. I don't think he has... Eerie insta down, or if he does, he never used it. I don't think he has eerie to break pallets and slow you down. That would be super obvious. Um, in fact, you it, it's you cannot break a pallet normally with it. So the eeries, I think, are ruled out. Uh, that was way too quick. So that means one of the three speed add-ons, maybe multiple. Uh, he could also have comp on 21, although he didn't strike me as the type. So the, the most common thing, and what's probably in here, is double speed. Dude, if this girl gets it. He could also have Adrenaline Vile. Dude, don't take your chances. Yeah, Adrenaline Vile would also give him speed and extra rushes. I haven't seen more than five. Uh, I, I think it's just double speed. Sometimes people run green speed, the crow, and then something else, but... Yeah. Dude, that's... Man, if I somehow just kept running, maybe I could have... We could have gotten a two-man out. Oh, oh. Oh, 
Okay, my bet is double speed, Chad. My bet is double speed. No, he. Ha I mean, he does have double speed, but it's 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 speed and speed from bio. So yeah, if you ask me, even though we did make some mistakes, it is an absolute miracle that we actually got one person out through the exegate. But instead of recognizing this, our teammate, the Fangmin, got very upset. They said that they were the ones doing gents, no one else is doing anything. And please don't be like this person. Sure, from their point of view, they did all the gents and they didn't really get chased much. But I think everybody else tried their best this match, even if it wasn't an incredible performance at the end of the day. Uh, I don't know, man. Like, you can't just judge a game from your own point of view and assume that everyone else is terrible and then get really, really upset. Uh, solo queue is rough enough as it is. Please do not gang up and, and be upset at your fellow players.